I'm truly tired of it. See, too many of you have fallen into a trap or into a lie thinking that women are the problem. It is women's fault you can't commit. It is women's fault you can't find a good woman. I'm here to tell you the difference. See, I'm here to tell you it's not women's fault. It's not their fault. It's yours. It's ours as men. And I'm gonna explain why. Let's hop into this. Number one, you think like an incel. Men, it's time that we take accountability for what we're doing wrong. See, many of these guys in these certain communities are almost incel thinking like. If you ever read their Reddit forums, they're always constantly bashing women and saying that it is the modern women's fault why they can't commit and settle down to a long-term relationship. It is women's fault that they always get rejected. And I'm here to tell you, buddy, it's not their fault. It is ours. See, women, just like us, have their own standards that they want met. These are the standards that they're looking for in a man. Once you understand this game, you're going to understand that these magical standards that women have are attainable. The, the, the wealth, the success, the good looking, the status, the body, all this stuff is attainable. The charisma, the dominance, this is attainable stuff. Is it easy? Absolutely not. It's much easier to blame someone. But here is the thing. If you take the easier path, the path of least resistance, which is blaming them instead of trying to achieve those standards, what ends up happening is you'll constantly see women as the enemy. You will constantly be bashing them and I promise you, no girl's gonna ever like you if you always see them as your enemy. Which rolls us on to number two. You're chasing the wrong women. Bro, you see this all the time. Look at basketball players getting caught out here with the renters of the world. So once men stop making decisions with this and start using this to choose their women, you'll see why choosing the wrong women will ruin your life. Number three, you don't even keep up with basic upkeep. See, I believe that as a dude, you, you, you basically attract what you want, right? So if you are constantly polishing yourself, taking care of yourself, valuing yourself, you're going to attract something on that level. But if you don't even have the basic upkeep, you don't even try when it comes to yourself, you're going to attract something similar or on that level. Bro, most guys aren't even taking care of themselves. Shoot, I would say about 80% of dudes, when I'm stuck in an elevator, most dudes in that elevator smell bad. That's because most guys just don't care. But this is why I talk so much about fragrances. Like, yo, some of my favorite fragrances, yes, they might be expensive, but I invest money in these fragrances for a reason. I know the importance of upkeep and taking care of yourself. Not only does it fill you with confidence, you impress others around you. You're more gratifying to be around. And I get it. Yo, expensive fragrances, th th this could be expensive. Like some of these bottles are like 300 bucks and most of you don't have the money for that. Totally understand. This is why with heat grooming, our body wash, our deodorant, I worked hard to make sure that the scent in those products smelled like a high-end fragrance. So those of you that don't have the money to afford a high-end or a great fragrance, you can at least afford a body wash, something that you can use daily to clean yourself. And when you step out the shower, you smell amazing. That in and of itself is already more than what most dudes are doing. Some dudes don't even shower in the morning. I don't want you to be that dude. Matter of fact, if you don't have a good smelling body wash or a good smelling fragrance, I want you to check out our body wash and our deodorant. And don't just take my word for it. Go click the link down below, check out the review, see what other guys are saying. Like if you see what they're saying, like yo, I I'm not making this stuff up. That could be you too. That could be you making that extra change in your life that what you need to do to level yourself up, make yourself feel more confident, but also present yourself in a high value way. If you guys want to check out our heat body wash and or our deodorant, I'm going to have it linked down below. Number four, you are too safe with women. See, a lot of guys end up getting played with women because they don't set up their boundaries early. See, as soon as you start taking things serious with the woman, you should be clear about your opinions and what you tolerate out of her. And many guys don't do this out of fear of losing her or that she might get annoyed or, or, or go off to another guy. But you have to understand that most women actually like this. Most women actually want a man that knows what they want out of a relationship. And listen, if she doesn't want to abide by your boundaries, don't even stress it. Just leave. There is no need to force her to abide. You just have to make your boundaries clear and know that these are non-negotiables and that decisiveness, that type of almost like dominance. I promise you problematic women, they're going to filter out and most of the women that attract to you will be attracted by that leadership skill. And finally, number five, you're pushing them away. See, a lot of times or most of you are able to attract women initially, but then over time, as times go by, it's almost like the women's interest starts to dwindle on them and it starts to fade. 
It's because you're too available. See, the problem with so many guys is that they, they place that crush or that girl as the number one thing in their lives over their goals, over their purpose, over their ambition. And the thing is that that's suffocating for them. Like no girl wants that much attention. They might say they do, but I promise you, nobody's gonna miss something that's constantly there all the time. I need you to stop prioritizing every single girl that gives you a little bit of attention and instead I want you to prioritize your purpose. I promise you, you start doing this, women will obsess over you. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget to check out Heat if you guys want a solid body wash and deodorant that's gonna make you smell manly. Click that link down below. That's it for me today. See you next time.